So tomorrow is Thanksgiving, a.k.a. the Day of Giving Thanks, a.k.a. the day Christopher Columbus came to the United States, I believe. But, uh, yeah, that's beside the point. Um, before I start this video, in order to celebrate the Day of Giving Thanks, I guess, I'm gonna give thanks by saying thank you guys for subscribing to me. We got, like, nearly 15,000 subscribers this year alone, which is absolutely insane. Like, that's, like, a third of our total subscribers. That's, that's a huge amount of subscribers. We're at 57,000. Let's get to 60,000 before the year ends. Um, and in order for me to say thanks, I went ahead and made, like, a little giveaway on my Discord server. So, uh, let me just, like, capture here. So you guys can see how to do this, but go ahead and join my Discord server. The link to my Discord server is in the bottom of every single video that I make. You're going to go over here on the left side, and on the left side, there's a giveaways tab. All you got to do is go to the giveaways tab, and then right here, this $10 Roblox uh, for thanks space giving, not Thanksgiving, because um, I'm giving thanks. Uh, but yeah, all you got to do is click on this little button right there. You see the one that keeps highlighting, and then you guys are going to be entered again get in the giveaway. Also, I'm trying to revive the Discord server. It's been kind of dead. So come back to the Discord server and make friends with people. Uh, alrighty. The, yeah, anyways, I hope you guys um, been having a really good time during your break. I know a lot of you guys are on break right now. So make sure you play AA, make sure you get caught up, make sure you're farming as much as you can in order to get the best stuff, better ingredients, better teats, Papa Russo, as you guys always know. Anyway, smash the like button, subscribe, turn notifications on, and let's go ahead and get into the intro now. It's time for Who Wrote That Comment? It's I Like Anime. And yeah, the meta's always changing, so make sure to watch my tier list videos. So we're loading back into Anime Adventures. I'm not gonna say Anime Fighter Simulator, even though I know I just said Anime Fighter Simulator. We're back into Anime Adventures, and the first thing I want you guys to tell me is what you think of my, once again, new costume that I got for this video specifically. So please let me know uh, what you think of it. I'm gonna go into the light over here, and you guys can kind of see it already, but um, yeah, ready for this? I don't think you guys are ready. Uh... Yeah, alrighty, there we go. Um, I think my favorite part about this costume specifically, uh, either the flying turkeys or the angry little turkey right there with the sword. I, I actually really love that, but uh, that's our costume for today. Uh, it's probably not my best creation, I'm not gonna lie. I thought this is a higher quality head, but um, yeah, we're not gonna talk about that, okay? What we are going to talk about is the fact that Levi Nagoonie and All Force are in the banner, so I'm not going to sell them for it. I'll, I'll do one ticket, and if I get a mythical, that's fantastic. That's experience, but nope, it's a Zoro. I'm also going to go ahead and get my ticket back right there. Boom. I kind of want to get this mythical fruit as well, but we're going to leave that alone. Um, really quickly, what I'm going to focus on today's video is this ice flower. So there it is. This new ice flower star is the reward for beating the dungeon from this update, or the infinity castle from this update up to floor 100. So the star says, I can't imagine this will make things any easier, but this is all I can do. Um, I'm gonna look that quote up real quick. I can't imagine this will make things any easier, but this is all I can do. Um, Amelia? Amelia is what shows up. So, Amelia is the anime character from ReZero that shows up. Unfortunately, some of these images are not PG, not even PG-13, so I can't show them. But maybe we're getting Amelia from ReZero. And to be honest with you guys, I don't know much about Amelia. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to just go ahead and share the one image that I can share, I think, of this, like, character. And then you guys will be like, oh, that one. You'll be like, yeah, I've seen that one before. So open image and new tab. And then let's do this. And let's just do this right here so you guys can see it. And then voila, that character right there is the reward for getting to floor 100. At least that's what I think the reward is. The other possible reward that we can be getting with this update with this flower star is going to be... Um, 
Oh, Esdeath is her name. Esdeath, the Ice Queen. You know who I'm talking about. So, yeah, well, I'm really hoping it's Esdeath, but it's probably gonna be that Anelia person, which I, like I said, I don't know nothing about her. So, there's that. Anyways, guys, I have some terrible... Oh, God, that was creepy. I have some terrible news. I went ahead and decided to reroll on my Bulma because, you know, Golden Bulma plus 20... Ooh, ooh, ah! <laughs> plus 20% gold? That sounds amazing, right? Wrong! I'm sorry, headphone users. I apologize. Why did this happen? Why did this happen? Why? I'm so sorry, headphone users. This only took me like five maybe 10 spins total guys on this Bulma and I got unique but not only did I get a unique I got a nimble too why couldn't I have gotten this on my Gojo per se or my you know that I was trying to get this on or even better yet King Julius who is a singular unit who would have benefited from this the most why did I get a unique nimble Boma? This doesn't even do anything for me. I know King already has a unique Boma, but now I have a unique nimble to Boma, guys. I'm not kidding. I do, I'm not making this up. I, it's just how bad my luck actually was. It's good. It's good luck, but it's also really, really, really bad luck. So I technically, when I equip a full unique team, it is literally a full unique team, including my uh, farm. Isn't that absurd? I actually have a full unique team if I'm gonna take a full unique team on me. I also have a uh, coyote over here, but um, yeah, th this is, I'm actually kind of really disappointed that that happened, but hopefully, I don't know, hopefully I can like re-roll on it later. I'm probably just gonna leave this one alone and I'll re-roll on my other Bulma that I just got right there. Um, she's not shiny though, which kind of sucks, but this is what you guys need to be doing to get that ice flower. I'm almost at stage 200. The reason I'm doing a little bit more of these this time is because of the fact that there's the new ranking system. I'm probably not gonna catch up to the tw top 25. Oh, there's another turkey. The top 25 players on this right here, to be honest with you guys. I do have the team to do that but it's getting a little bit more difficult on these higher stages like once you get to stage 150 you needed to start paying attention and then there's like the types advantage so let's go ahead and teleport into 197 so i can show you guys how these stages actually look like um just a reminder for when you guys are actually doing these you're still gonna get 150 gems every time you do this so if by some let's call it some miracle i make it to wave or to round 300 which I'll keep trying, but Infinity Castle, yeah, 197, 200, it's probably gonna be enough for me, as long as I'm in like the top 50 and I get myself like a nice reward, right? But if I can get to 300 in total, I will have earned 45,000 gems from doing the Infinity Castle, which is an amazing amount of gems, which I suggest every single one of you go and try to get. Now look at this, you see these, these senior investigators, they have 1800 health and they have resistance to both of the units. Less resistance to magic, which is like specifically good for me because I do use Gojo of course and then I use, uh, uh, what's his face? Ah, no, they got through. Ah, whatever, I am concerned about him actually. Uh, let's just go ahead and place a Lucy down. Lucy is like a unit I have not been using at all, guys. I have not been using Lucy, which is kind of, I don't know, I kind of feel bad about not using her, but she's just there. There's my Bulma. Honestly, hey, Scripts or Stray, if you're listening to this, can we just make unique Bulma like two times stronger? Like, this is, this is so disappointing to have gotten a unique passive on Bulma and actually get zero rewards from it. It hurts me that this happened, guys. But, uh, yeah, as you guys can see, the stages really aren't that difficult. I'm gonna probably keep going. In realist, in reality, I could probably honestly go for the leaderboard spots, like the top 25, but do I really feel like doing that? Eh, I don't know. 
the EC, there we go, destroy that. I can sell Gojo here. I can plug Gojo back up here and then I can just upgrade Gojo right there to purple or hollow red. And then boom, I can kind of just sit AFK for a little bit, letting Gojo and uh, Negoni do all the work for me right there. Um, start working on the Dolmas and so on and so forth. So let me go ahead and just keep upgrading. I'll be right back once we get close to the end of the stage. So as you can see, it really wasn't that hard to do this stage. Um, it only took me less than seven minutes, so I can keep doing these, and I will keep doing these. I'll probably have like 40 something thousand gems by the next update if they update this weekend. So make sure you guys are doing these, get all the gems you can, and get yourself your free Shivaka, I mean reward. Free reward, you know? And yeah, that's it. I hope you guys like this. If you do, make sure to smash the like button, subscribe, Turn notifications on, and I'll see you in the next one. Reese's Thesis, look at that angry turkey. Bye!